Hello, visitor one at one two three, bringing you Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic one. Today we shall be uh, getting our lightsaber and stuff like that. Acquire. Runda di hotonga kun hunka bi ka chi kun ita hotonga i king kuno bamulera chi kun. Runda di achuta achuta wonga kun bi stolpi. You there, Padawan. Why are you not wearing the customary robes of the Jedi? Do you mock the honor tradition? My name is Balai. Any. Bastila, but as for you, you claim you are not a Padawan? If this is some type of jest, it is in very poor taste. Please forgive the abruptness. I wish you a pleasant stay. They're waiting for you inside. Ah, so you are the one who rescued Bastila. It is appropriate you are here. We have been discussing your rather special case. I am Jar, a member of the Jedi Council. With me are Master Vruk, Master Vandar, and of course the chronicler of our academy, Master Dorak. Padawan Bastila, I am sure you are already familiar with. Yes, the High Council of the Jedi Order is on Coruscant, but we are the Council in charge of the training facility here on Dantooine. Bastila tells us you are strong in the Force. Master Jar speaks out of turn, perhaps. We need indisputable proof of your strong affinity to the Force before we would even consider accepting you for training. Proof? Surely the entire Council can feel the strength of the Force within this man. And I've already related to you the events that took place on Terrace. Perhaps it was simple luck. We both know there is no luck. There is only the Force. We all feel the power in Bastila's companion, though it is wild and untamed. Now that this power has begun to manifest itself, can we safely ignore it? The Jedi training is long and difficult, even when working with a young and open mind. Teaching a child is hard. How much harder will it be for an adult to learn the ways of the Jedi? Traditionally, the Jedi do not accept adults for training, though there are rare exceptions in the history of our order. But you are a special case. I agree with Master Dorak. Many of our own pupils are leaving the Jedi Order to follow the Sith teachings. We need recruits to stand against Malak. With Revan dead... Are you certain Revan is truly dead? What if we undertake to train this one and the Dark Lord should return? We should discuss this matter more fully in private. Bastila, you and your companion must go. This is a matter for the Council alone. As you wish, Master Vandar. We shall return to the Ebon Hawk and leave you to your deliberations. Another dream. The dark side is strong in this place. I can feel its power. That is a good analogy. Is this wise? The ancient Jedi sealed this archway. If we pass beyond this door, we can never go back. The Order will surely banish us. Are the secrets of the Star Forge so valuable? Can its power truly be worth the risk?
This morning's getting stranger by the minute. First, Bastila comes out looking like she saw a ghost, and now you. Well, Bastila did mention that you should go to the council chambers before she left. It's no doubt urgent, so you shouldn't... You got it. Yes. Oh, you want to argue some more? And I don't want to argue with you either. I mean, you seem sincere enough, I guess. I just don't trust easily. And for good reasons. Oh, damn it. I suppose I won't get any rest until I talk, will I? You want to know why I don't trust anyone? Fine. Here goes. Five years ago, the Jedi had just finished the war with the Mandalorians. Revan and Malak were heroes. I was damn proud to have served in their fleet. It was completely unexpected when they turned on us, invading the Republic while we were still weak. Nobody knew what to think, least of all me. Our heroes had become brutal, conquering Sith, and we were all but helpless before them. I mean, think about it. If you can't even trust the best of the Jedi, who can you trust? It's not that. It's... Malak and Revan and the Sith deserve to die for what they've done, but the ones who fled the Republic and joined them are even worse. The dark side has nothing to do with why they joined with the Sith. They deserve no mercy. I know. I'm... And I should apologize. It's just... No, never mind. Let's just continue with... Interesting conversation. Enjoy the time you have here on Dantooine. I think the council might decide. Bastila has told us of a most unusual development. She claims you and she have shared a dream. A vision of Malak and Revan in the ancient ruins here on Dantooine. These ruins have long been known to us, but we believe them to be merely burial mounds. Perhaps they're more than we first suspected, if Revan and Malak found something there. Bastila has described this shared dream to the Council in great detail. We feel it is more... You and Bastila share a powerful connection to the Force, and each other. This is not unheard of. Connections often form between master and student. But rarely does a bond develop so quickly. Whatever dangers may lie ahead, we cannot ignore the destiny that has brought you and Bastila here to us. Together. You and she are linked, as is your fate to hers. Together, you two may be able to stop. But do not let your head be filled with visions of glory and power. Such thought, the way of the light. Understand that they're the Sith. Other Je The lure of the dark side is not easy to resist. Malak's power grows as more and more planets fall to his con- If Malak is not stopped, the Republic will fall, and the Jedi will be hunted to extinction. The galaxy will enter a time of darkness and tyranny, not seen for a thousand generations. The Council has decreed that you and Bastila must investigate the ancient ruins you dreamed of. Perhaps there you will find some clue. The Force flows through you like no student we have ever seen. But you're willful and headstrong, a dangerous combination. Before we send you to investigate... We must begin your training. I can only hope. The path you have chosen to walk is difficult. Intensive training will prepare you physically for the demands of the Order. Meditation will teach you to channel the power of the Force. To truly understand the way of the Jedi, you must open your mind to knowledge. Seek wisdom in the teachings of the great masters of our Order. A Jedi is never alone. Others in the Order will always stand by you. You and Bastila share a special bond. Do not be afraid to turn to her when you need help in your training.
The way of the Jedi is difficult. It requires great discipline. Yet even though you are a mere apprentice, your potential is unlimited, and your progress amazing. In all my years, I have never seen one who has mastered the initial training so quickly. You have done in weeks what many cannot do in years. I am honored to welcome you fully into the Jedi Order. Soon your apprenticeship will end, and you will be granted the title of Padawan, the lowest rank of those within the Jedi Order. Yet first you must prove yourself worthy. In the tradition, these tests first you must prove. my pen and pencil out. Greetings, as a the man. Of course I instead exo I see you do not know the Jedi code. Without knowledge of those doctrines, all your training will be for naught. All Jedi must know the code. Its tenets are the fundamental teachings of our order. There is no emotion. There is peace. There is no ignorance. There is knowledge. There is no passion. There is serenity. There is no chaos. There is harmony. Learn. Greeting. In the tradition. These ten. For you might. There is. That is not the greeting in the fur you there. That is not the greeting. Oh boy, I'm feeling it. So in the truth, these fur you there. Is that is not the greeting. <sighs> I'm doing a horrible job. In the you must there. There is no ignorance. There is no. Pa there is no. C that is not correct. There is. Oh, screw you. Greeting. In the. the for you there. Is that is. Re greeting. In the. For you there. That is rit greeting. I'm really getting annoyed by this. In the, the for you, there is there is that is not the return greeting. In the for you, there there that is not the rit greeting. You there. There. That is not. Re greeting. Screw you. In you there. That is not. Re greeting. In the. For you might there is. That is not. Re greeting. You have learned much. When you feel that. You greeting. In the the fur you there there is that is not re greeting in the the you there is there is there is there is that is not re Greeting. In the, the first you there. There. There is. There is no. That is not. Re okay, so greeting. That one. Soon in the, the first you there is. There, there is. There is no.
That is not return. Wait, yes. Greeting. Horse. In the the for you there. That is not the rich. Okay, what the hell is it? I'm going to cut this until I beat the quiz. Okay, so I beat it like five minutes after, so we'll continue on. Good evening, a I have. I see you. It appears that soon you will achieve the rank of Padawan. Master Jar is more. Ah, the. T Blue is the color of the Jedi Guardian. This Jedi battles against the forces of evil and the dark side. They focus more on combat training and use of the lightsaber. Yellow is the color of the Jedi Sentinel. This Jedi ferrets out to green. Indeed. We shall see. A what? You are in Yes, there is I am beginning to see a p you are Yes, as a which Here is a blue crystal for your lightsaber. Go speak to Master Jar again, and he will instruct you in how to construct it. Ah, good. Now that... done extremely well in constructing your lightsaber, Apprentice. Your crystal seems to have been set perfectly. It is rare indeed for that to happen the first time one constructs their lightsaber. These crystals are very rare, found only in certain caves strong in the Force. By adding crystals to your lightsaber, you can alter or enhance its properties. There have even been unconfirmed rumors of certain Force-sensitive caves here on Dantooine that may hold these crystals. It is a rumor only. I do not know if there's any truth in it, but you must learn first to use your lightsaber. Your lightsaber identifies you as a member of the Jedi Order. With such, the Sith and Dark Jedi will seek to destroy you, Apprentice. And you must prove yourself worthy in battle against a foe who also... Are you ready to face the fight? For every Jedi that even here, the ancient, the cat... The Cathounds are but a symptom of the true problem. 
you must journey into the grove and confront the true source of the darkness. That is... I can say, but the dark... It is good sometimes to stop. I am sorry. I tend to get. Is there something I can. Are you a Jedi? How long? Protectors. Ha! You sit in your enclave safe from the Mandalorian. No! They've been raiding planets across this sector and farms around. You Jedi have left them alone because... I say we look for these Mandalorians. I fought them in the war. They're nothing but vicious pirates. We should... we should stop them if we can. Those Mandalorian brutes have killed my daughter. They came to our land demanding our livelihood. But Ilse... There was nothing I could do. I... Just please, annihilate them from the face of this planet. Oops.
Steps on this will get a nasty shock. Whoever steps on this will get a nasty sh whoever ste steps on this will get a nasty shock. <laughs> No!
thought they you think compliments will convince <sighs> talk 
Lies. I talk. You, you. I am but that. I always. You think. I have fallen. Talk. Lies. I have. Talk. Lies. I have fallen. Talk. Not anger. Peace. I am. I have put. Why? Do not look at me again. I have fallen. Talk. Lies. Thinking of using technicalities to do the deed. Act or be gone. Talk. Not anger. I am, but I would. Why? Do not look at me. Foolishness is the fact cannot leave me. I am I, I seem to still have much to learn, but I wish no. it is. It was leave me. I do not know. But learning does not have to it was I. Leave me to. I do not know. She knew. Inst it was. Leave me. I do not know. If she were. How can. I should convince. Maybe. Just maybe. Do you think they would? I thank you, Master Jedi. I will return to the. Again. Okay, that'll be it for now. This has been another Star Wars Night's Elbow Republic episode. See you later, and goodbye, my friends.